We previously learned how to create a chart of account and auxiliary accounts. We will learn now how to create journal vouchers. We will enter the system to see how we should do it. We notice in the home menu that we have journal vouchers. We open it then we will have the list of vouchers displayed. In our case, we only have one in the database. We click on new from the upper menu. The voucher screen will then open. We can hide the left menu to display the voucher on the whole screen. The voucher type can be vouchers, loans, payment note. And each voucher type has a different serial number. We can simplify work by choosing the same type, which is voucher, but it is recommended to specify the types of vouchers for later filtering and specially for debit and credit notes which should be used in VAT declarations. In branch you select on which branch this voucher will be applied and if you have a multi-branch we choose the branch for this journal voucher and definitely each branch has its own serial number. The number will be filled automatically after saving the voucher. We fill the voucher date manually. Here we can fill the reference manually to benefit from it in the reports. In description you enter the full details of the journal voucher. For example we can fill invoice number and its related information. In Ledger you search the account by number or by name in Arabic or English. So if we search for 6261 for example or for words that begin with Tela we will have the accounts that begin with Tela to choose from. We click enter. We can define the auxiliary for this ledger. You can choose the currency. Enter the debit or credit amount. We click the downward arrow, it will automatically open a new line for us. We can search for another ledger like 44216 and click enter. We can link the ledger number to auxiliary account like Ojero and enter the debit amount and click on downward arrow. We search for ledger number. We choose the auxiliary. The amount will be displayed automatically in the credit column having the sum of the debit amount in order to close the voucher. Since this voucher is paid cash, so we should close it by debiting the amount of the auxiliary and credit the amount of cash by £111,000. These were the basics of journal voucher, we will talk in the next videos about the other options. Thank you.